Hello everybody, you're watching Curious Palo. I have never paid attention, actually, to St. Patrick's Day, but turns out it has some curiosities to offer to us. So I made a small research, results are ready, and here they are. In this video, we're gonna be talking about St. Patrick. Who is he? Why he has a day? Christianity, snakes, leprechauns, gold, and few more things. Let's begin. What is St. Patrick's Day? It's a day that commemorates St. Patrick. It's an annual celebration that is happening on the 17th of March, the day of his death. But who was St. Patrick and what did he do? St. Patrick was a Christian missionary credited for converting Ireland to the Christianity. He is the patron saint of Ireland even though he is not Irish. So many legends surround his life, the truth is not easy to be found. Like this one. St. Patrick drove all the snakes out of Ireland. Here's what we know. St. Patrick was on a 40-day fest on the top of a hill. Imagine this. Sitting there on the top of the hill, festing. And then suddenly, snakes attack him. But Patrick then chased the snakes into the sea. Two things here. One, there are no snakes in Ireland. Good till now. Two, there have never been snakes in Ireland. So how can you get rid of something that has never been there? That tickled my curiosity. How a country has no snakes? Turns out there are a few other countries like that. Like Antarctica, no surprise here. Newfoundland, Ireland and New Zealand. Hey Mike. Three is Ireland's magic number and the three petals of the shamrock are supposed to bring good luck. We think the four petals of the shamrock bring good luck because it's much more difficult to find. Why do people wear green on St. Patrick's Day? If you wear green clothing, you'll be invisible to the leprechauns. These are fairy creatures that will pinch anybody they could see. Anybody who doesn't wear green. So if you go on a St. Patrick's parade and people start pinching you, that is because you're not wearing green, not because they find you attractive. On more serious note, green is one of the colors in the Irish flag. Also, the color of spring, the shamrocks, and the green landscape Ireland is offering to us. People wear green and eat corned beef cabbage. When was the first St. Patrick's Day parade? Believe it or not, it wasn't in Ireland. It happened in the 1760s and it was in New York City. Hey, those Americans. But it wasn't the Americans actually, it was the Irish people that were living there. As more and more Irish people were moving to America, in the 19th century, the holiday was celebrating throughout the USA. The shamrock, pot of gold and leprechauns are also associated with St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day has become a holiday all around the world and for one day in the year, everybody can be Irish. I'm curious to find out, have you participated in a St. Patrick's Day parade? And what was your experience? Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching till here and I'll see you in the next video.